Hello everyone, this is Renee from Paramount Solutions in Orlando, Florida. We are a small privately owned psychic service. We would love to help you. If you have any questions about life or any kind of issues in general, please call us at 1-800-966-2294. We always have new client specials and we usually have current client specials. We would love to help you with anything that you have going on in your life. Um, we are actually going to be having a total lunar eclipse taking place this Friday on July 27th of 2018. It really could be quite life-changing. It could be energy-changing. It could be um, really exciting for a lot of different people because of the various retrogrades we have going on. A long time, they're going to be amplified with the lunar energy, which the lunar energy is generally feminine energy. Um, the sun is the masculine energy, and then the lunar is the feminine energy. So things could get a little exciting here. Um, this is going to be the longest uh, lunar eclipse of the century, um, and then it's also going to be influenced. Um, it's actually going to be happening in Aquarius. Um, but it's going to be also uh, influenced by the Mars retrograde and the Mercury retrograde. Um, the Mars retrograde is going to be focusing on inner energy. It could be inner energy of yourself, of a group, of a you know large, large group. Um, it could also, um, the Mercury retrograde will actually can cause issues with communication. So, and that one's actually gonna be in Leo. And so there's a lot of just different fixed signs going into this. Um, it's going to make things a little bit um, difficult to contend and, and could be a little bit of a serious change. Um, all of this celestial activity with retrogrades and fixed signs, which um, it's going to be, it's actually going to be a really strong energy boost with the lunar eclipse. Um, we have the Aquarius energy, which is for the greater good, um, the introspective energy from Mars, along with communication issues of Mercury. Um, it can be all influenced and strengthened by the lunar eclipse. Um, there will be a strong tendency to focus on matters that are important to everyone. And there may be, in, um, people are going to want to really fix things because of the Aquarius energy. Um, however, there's going to be a tendency to look inward and feel frustration and, you know, and anger if, if things are not moving forward quickly enough, which happens with Mars. Um, and then on top of it, Mercury does can cause a little bit of confusion because of the communication breakdowns. So this could be exciting for all of us. Um, so anyway, um, people, things that could happen, um, people are likely to react in negative fashion to news or events or even make bad political choices. Um, social media um, can turn out to be a little troublesome issue for a lot of people because of mis miscommunication. There might be misunderstandings. Um, they might believe the wrong sources. Um, friends that you normally um, are really, you know, really good friends with. Um, there might be some shortcomings in your relationships and romantic relationships. Um, we're actually going to advise you not to make any rash decisions or, you know, just based on the chaotic events, you know, in that energy. Um, people that are going to be affected are going to be, you know, the Aquarius is Leo's, but there's also the Gemini and Taurus. Um, it looks like Gemini and Taurus might have a very difficult time with this event. General, you know, Gemini is live to communicate and they might find that the energy really is, is really annoying and confusing. Um, the Taurus, um, they usually, they really like comfort and beauty and they may really put their head down and clean the house <laughs> is what they might do. Um, or even, you know, maybe straighten up and organize things because things are a little bit chaotic. Um, the influence on Mars is going to actually make things a little bit more volatile. Um, this blood moon lunar eclipse, which the blood moon is actually just a Native American name for this moon that happens in July. Um, and it has the ability, um, this blood moon will kind of cause a little bit of discomfort and drama, but it is also a very big opportunity to get rid of bad things that are maybe in your life and then, you know, getting rid of those and then bringing on a whole new light and a whole new energy into the new situation. And obviously we're going to be going through Mercury retrograde and Mars retrograde and then along with Saturn. And so it's going to be a little bit of a, you know, difficult energy through the rest of the summer. However, things should be looking up. So I just wanted to give you a little encouragement. If you have any questions, please call us. We would love to help. We have many readers who focus on all of this. Um, we do have excellent readers who work with us. They are all clairvoyant. Some of them use tarot cards. Some of them are psychic mediums. It just depends on what you're looking for. We usually have somebody who can really, really help you and who can give a really good reading for you. So if you have any questions, please call us at 1-800-966-2294 or check us out um, on our website at www.thepsychicline.com. Thank you and have a great week.